Okay, hold on. I just realized something. Some streaming the window, I bet. Hmm. Huh, maybe not. Okay. Um. Oh, I, I, I forgot what I was going to say. Whatever. Okay. Oh, I guess I am gonna need my phone, huh? <clears throat> so where were we? We were on... We're only on 5-2? Okay. I guess I should make sure. Yep. Dark mode turned itself off, so I gotta turn that back on. Okay, who's here? Anyone here? Probably not. I guess I'll start up, at least. Oh, I trust the volume's probably all weird. Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. Hmm. Okay, cool, I do have these. All right, that's good. Hey 
there, Moo Cow. You'll never see it coming. All right. Uh. Oh, by the way, um, I mean, I guess Moo Cow is probably the only one here, but I mean, you'll be interested to hear this news. Um, I might, and the, I no promises on this. I mean, it will become a thing eventually. Okay, cool. Uh, it, it will definitely be eventually. I'm not sure when, but hopefully soon. I'll be able to stream some Switch games because I plan on getting a capture card for it. But it all depends on when I get the money for it. I mean, I technically have the money now. I could get it now if I wanted to. But it. The capture card I'm looking at is like $180. And. My paycheck isn't even that much. Because I'm part time. So. But I also get paid weekly. So if I were to get paid every other week. If I already get paid every other week, it would be, um, it would be, like, enough for the card, I know that much. Um, what games am I playing on streaming? I'm, I'll probably do Odyssey at some point, even though I've played through the game at least twice. I'll probably play through it again. Um, I don't have Breath of the Wild, so I won't be streaming that. I, I, I really have no interest in Breath of the Wild. It looks great. But it just doesn't seem like my type of game. So, I pro I'm gonna skip out on Breath of the Wild like I have been. Um, where's the bathhouse? Here we go. That's what the game wants me to do, right? Yeah. Um, I'll definitely be... I've been playing so much Hyrule Warriors lately, so I'm definitely gonna stream that. And that's the whole reason why I'm getting a capture card for the Switch. So I can stream some Hyrule Warriors, but... I'll, I'll, I'll stream other games too, so, you know, make it worth my purchase. Oh. Um, definitely gonna be streaming Smash when it comes out. Definitely streaming Smash when it comes out. Probably not gonna pick up the new Pokemon game though, because it looks like hot garbage. But, yeah. Um... Yeah, that, that, I'm trying to think of what else I have on my Switch. Let me take a look, I got it right here. Oh. Got it in handheld mode, so. Lo I love the Switch. Like, I was kind of, it's kind of hit or miss at first. Yeah. Um, the Switch, in my opinion, was hit or miss at first, but just the sheer portability of it. It's nice. I can play it downstairs without needing a TV and just play it like it's a DS or something so let's see what I have um all right I some of the more popular games I've got uh okay all right I'm gonna try and multitask here too um I got Kirby Star Allies which I Yeah. Um, I got Kirby Star Allies, which I probably won't play through again because I didn't particularly enjoy it. I mean, it was okay, but that's all it was, in my opinion. Okay. Definitely playing Odyssey. Uh, I probably won't stream Splatoon 2 just due to the nature of the game. Like, it's a multiplayer game. I mean, granted, there is stream lag that I have going for me so no one would be able to like give me an advantage or anything by telling me where to go or what to do but I don't know I I, I don't want to stream like multiplayer games like competitive online multiplayer games so I'm probably gonna skip out on Splatoon 2 there might do Mario Kart 8 Deluxe not sure cuz single player is kinda boring with that Um, let's see, what else do I have? I've got Toho Azure Reflections, but, eh, um, I played it once, it was, it's okay, but it's not really the game I'd want to play again. I've got Disgaea 5, which I might play through, 
Um, even though I've played through that a couple times, and it's gotten kind of boring, but... If I stream it, it might bring something new to the table, so we'll see. Uh, Super Mario Party... Probably not gonna stream that. Because, you know, Mario Party's no fun by yourself. If I, if I get some people over here to do it with me, then yeah, but I don't have friends. I mean, I do, but none that live near me who would be interested in playing Mario Party. Uh, Disgaea 1 complete. That one I might skip out on. Alright, PlayStation. I see how it is. Mukau, I still think it's a good game. I just... I just... It's not a game I would stream because it's... Like, it's not a game I would stream just because, um... Like, by... By... By yourself. It's, it's not as fun to, like, stream a game by yourself. Like, if it's a single-player game, then yeah. But yeah, I love Super Mario Party. It's it if it's not the best Mario Party, it's near the top. Like I honestly think it's better than seven and nine. But then again, everyone says it's better than nine. Everyone hates nine. I don't get it. I love nine. Like I I get that the mini game, not mini game. Uh, the mini stars thing was. Like, the whole Mini Stars thing was kind of weird, but I actually liked it. Um, I never did like the whole Getting Stars gameplay. It felt too luck-based, and I guess Mini Stars are still luck-based, but... Eh. Um... I forgot where I was going with this, but I, I just like 9. I, I feel like it's an unpopular opinion, but I really like 9. I don't think it's as good as 7, but... But yeah, um... I think it's Super Mario Party, then 7, then 9. And then after that, I don't really know. I've only ever really played 8 besides all that. Like... Eight's the only other Mario Party I've really played besides the ones I already listed. And I actually kind of like 8 too, but... Not nearly as much as I like 9. And then I've also got Hyrule Warriors, which I've said I'm going to stream, so... Ugh. So, uh, so just assuming I can buy this capture card tomorrow when I get paid, which I don't know if I'll be able to do, but assuming I can, then I can... My mother has Amazon Prime, so I'll just use her account, which has my credit card on it, so that... I, I can I can still pay for it. I can still pay for it and um But it's with her Prime account so I get two day shipping. That's how we've been doing it. Um So with any luck the capture card would get here Thursday and I might be able to stream on Thursday. If if it doesn't get here by Thursday or if I'm not able to buy it then if I have to buy it like Wednesday or something, mm -hmm. then don't count on a stream Friday for Switch, because that's Persona. That's 5 Friday. So, I guess I could do Disgaea 5 instead. That's still a 5. Um, but... Eh. Hey. Well, I haven't been streaming every night anyway, Moocow. In fact, I actually did skip out on last Friday, which is why I'm playing Persona now. It's because I skipped out on Friday. I haven't streamed since, like, I think it was Thursday. I don't know. I just haven't been feeling it lately. Like, I like streaming and all, but it also feels kind of like a chore to do it every night. Sometimes. But don't get me wrong. I love streaming for you guys. I just... I feel like I'd be more motivated if I had more viewers. Like... If I had more people watching me, it'd be like, oh yeah, it, it would feel more worthwhile to me.
That's why I'm that's why I'm hoping I get this capture card is because um I feel like that'll really spice it up a bit. It adds a lot more selection. Thanks, Mukau. I appreciate it. Yeah, these next couple of uh, in-game days are going to be mostly story-related, so yeah, we won't be making a whole lot of progress tonight in terms of, like, Make sure to actual gameplay. <sighs> Don't get cocky with me. Welcome. Am I interrupting something? Not at all. The cause of the runaway train incident in the subway the other day still has not been found. Police are hurrying to solve the matter as it may relate to the rise in psychotic breakdown incidents. Oh, is that the thing everyone's been talking about? Doesn't it make you curious? People who were living normal lives suddenly went mad or deranged out of the blue. Not to mention that it's happening one after another. Could they really be coincidental? Hmm. Leaving that aside, what do you have? Hmm. I'll have the house blend, please. Are you a part-timer? I'm surprised this place can afford one. Th that's exactly the case. Are you a high school student? Where do you attend? Oh, someone I know goes there as well. I've heard that things are rough right now. A teacher named Kamoshida confessed his crimes like he was a completely different person, supposedly. And it happened all of a sudden one day. Can a person's mental state change so easily? Huh. What's it to ya? Is my drink ready yet? Coming right up. <laughs> Shall we go? Let's sell it at the shop. that the treasures are like coated in catnip I don't know if you were here when we got the treasure when we got Kamoshida's treasure but he was just like like you literally made cat noise instead of talking all right let's go to Central Street Wow, can't even go to the velvet room today, okay. You don't have any Sony consoles, Mukau? Because if you have a PS2, you could get Persona 3 FES. If you have a Vita, you could get Persona 4 Golden. 
If you had PS2, you could get Persona 4, just the vanilla edition. But... Ah, uh, okay. enough. GameCube games are great. See ya. Mm. Okay. What, each of the Persona games? Yeah. Yeah, I mean... I, I guess they do kind of have a different feel to them, huh? Which is... I guess that makes sense, like... You don't want to just make the same game over and over again. with her. I was wondering about that. I don't remember when we got that, but... Hmm. It's odd. Alright, fine, Morgana. I'll go the <laughs> fuck to sleep. Ha ha, Moo Cow. Ha. Ha ha.
Mm. <laughs> so good. Yeah, I wonder where Chandler is. I know he's in the chat, or he was. I thought he'd be interested in this. No wonder Lady Han chose this place. Of course it's good. This is a famous hotel after all. Oh yeah, I heard that the police are coming to interview some people at school. I wonder where Reap is too, because usually Reap's here. That's troublesome. Our names are gonna come up for sure. People are spreading all sorts of rumors about us and Kamoshida. But we got him pumped up. I keep hearing stuff like the Phantom Thieves really stole his heart. I think most people don't believe it, but some of them actually seem grateful. Look at this. The Phantom Aficionado website? Well done, Phantom Thieves. Now I can keep going too. Thank you for giving us hope. Pretty cool, huh? I was just desperate to deal with my own problems, but seeing people saying all this feels strange. Yeah. Hey, what do we do now? Well, of course I'm gonna eat, but... <gasps> this place has a time limit! Oh crap! We only got an hour to eat! Just 50 minutes left! Oh, I'm not gonna finish all the beef dishes at this pace! I need to eat my way through the entire dessert menu! Look after our stuff. We'll snag something for you guys, too. Don't worry. Oh, man. God melts in my mouth. Seriously? Only meat? Now, where should I start? Yep. And she's all about the cake. So happy! <laughs> hey, calories. Shut up! How much do you think one of these costs? I'll never get the chance to do this again! Mm, the Wilton Hotel Cake Buffet! I'd heard rumors, but I never thought it'd be so amazing! <laughs> And where's our share? I didn't really know what you'd want. So I just grabbed you some beans. B beans? There were some pretty bizarre things there too. So we got you a variety of those. Fried bananas, preserved eggs, and some kind of beans. M more beans? <laughs> beans, beans. They're good for your heart. The more you eat, the more you so much on the plate that it got all mixed up but it should probably still taste good this is just plain grotesque beans beans are good for your heart the more you eat the more you slowly die inside right right let's go these two just don't know what fine dining means we'll show them That's reassuring. You guys are <laughs> that gone. Wait patiently for our return. <laughs> That's not good for your heart. That's not good for your heart at all. <laughs> oh, it's like a meaty explosion in my mouth. Okay. Oh, this part's cream cheese. They're not even listening.
How do you get the meat dishes? <laughs> oh, which of these? Which of these? Ah, uh, this one. when I saw the closed for cleaning sign at the bathrooms. You were talking big about eating until you puked, but you really did puke. Are you some kind of moron? Hey, same goes for you. Yep, th this... This game's society is, like, brutal. Was that restaurant on? We came up to get here, so it has to be on a lower floor, right? What the? There's still no update on the case. Uh, not yet. Excuse me, but. Why are you so involved? It's not something you should be concerned with. 
I don't care about your opinion, you incompetent buffoon. When I say pick up the pace, you do it. This guy has a portrait. He's surely not important at all. Hey, you're cutting in line. What do you want? We're in a hurry. Oh, I'm sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? It seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? What? Sir, we don't have time for this. I know. Damn! Shouldn't we head back down? Yeah, but... That dick really pissed me off. He wasn't even hiding the fact that he looks down on everyone. Don't lose your temper over this. I just can't forgive shitty adults like that. What's wrong? Sure, you're not looking so hot. It's probably because he never eats well. I'm always stuck with canned cat food, too. Yeah, that sir bullshit makes me sick. Damn it! What took you so long? Are you all pissy? Sorry. I had a run-in with some woman a second ago. She bumped into me, but then said it was all my fault when she dropped her plate. Fun fact. In the animated version of this, they actually show that scene. <laughs> Sounds like a real bitch. Yeah. Thanks, though. But the restaurant workers all looked at me with this disapproving expression. I wonder if we're out of place here. <clears throat> hey, Morgana. What is it? Anyone could have a palace, yeah? Anyone with a strong, distorted desire. Same for them having to change a heart if their treasure gets stolen? That would be the case. Why are you bringing this up all of a sudden? We had trouble earlier, too. These selfish shitheads who just look down on everyone else. I was just wondering if we'd be able to change those kinds of people, too. You mean, you want to continue as the Phantom Thieves? I've been thinking. We put a lot of work into changing Kamoshida's heart, but nobody believes in the Phantom Thieves. Plus, those guys who had no other choice but to just deal with it are thanking us. Us, of all people! I... I agree. If we ignore people who are in trouble, I'd go back to being the same as I was before. Well, that's true. You're under my tutelage. There's nothing we can't accomplish as Phantom Thieves. Shouldn't we be able to help him out? But... That means we'll have to fight Shadows again, doesn't it? Indeed. That can't be avoided. Eh, I'm sure manage. Oh, why does that keep happening? <laughs> right. Hm. Even if you guys are still just fledglings, this means we're an actual organization now. No, Mukau, this isn't uh, this isn't an emulation. And I'm not saying that Oh, I love this part of the music. But um 
the this I'm not just saying that because you know I don't want to get banned. This actually is not emulation. I'm using the PS4's remote play to project this from my PS4 to my PC. But this is my actual PS4 playing this, and that's why it's acting so odd at times. It's acting choppy. It's because the connection sometimes isn't as good at sometimes as is at others. So, but yeah, this is my official PS4. Like, this is my actual PS4 playing this game. It's just, I'm using an... an yeah, it'd be really nice if Nintendo had that so I didn't have to buy a freaking capture card to stream Switch games. That'd be really freaking nice. Fledglings? <laughs> That's actually pretty fitting for us. Alright, it's settled. We're gonna catch all these shitty adults by surprise and make ourselves known to the world. Are you okay being our leader? No objections here? I can't handle all that responsibility stuff. Where's my say in this? But Lady Ahn made the recommendation, so I'll allow it. Well, should we decide on a name for our group? I just went with Phantom Thieves of Hearts last time, but don't you think a real name would be cooler? Ooh, I got it. I want it to be something both cute and luxurious sounding. Let me see. How about the diamonds? <laughs> I'm getting the real Little League Baseball feel from it. Well then, here's my suggestion. How about Tilefish Poilé? Tile, uh, what? That's what I ate earlier. It's commemorative, no? Hell no, you idiot! Uh, you decide for us. <laughs> Say that a bit louder, Ryuji, why don't you? This, it's gonna be a running trend in this game that, like, Ryuji cannot keep his voice down at all. And, spoiler alert, at one point it actually gets him into a bit of trouble. Not gonna say when or how, but it does come back to bite him. Does what become plot relevant? The name? Um... Oh, okay. So, this is where you can, uh, you can enter in your own name. The default is the Phantoms, which is what I'm going to be going with because I'm boring. However, if you name it the Diamonds, you'll get a special little thing from on. Like, not an item, but like you'll get a special little, like, dialogue thing from her. Yeah, nah. Nah. Huh. That's not bad at all. A good name. For a rookie. We going with that? Well, now that the name's set, who's our next target? There are tons of rotten adults and all. Why not just stick to targeting big names? Yeah, something along those lines. If we go after some bigwig, it's gotta get on the news, right? Don't you think more people would believe in us if we did that? That's not a bad idea. For you, Ryuji. True. If we become better known, we might be able to give courage to a lot more people. I don't really like the idea of just picking someone out of the blue, though. Let's narrow it down to someone we can all agree on, then. 
Hmm. So we need a big wig we decide on unanimously. I like that unanimous decision part. It's like we're making some kind of pact. Now then, this is the official formation of the Phantom Thieves Organization. Oh no! Our time for the buffet ran out. <laughs> I guess Let's we'll just have to cult. talk more tomorrow. Another world in which people's distorted cognitions take shape? Stealing treasure to change hearts? And on top of that, a talking cat told you all this. Honestly speaking, that all sounds absurd. It's hard to believe that this is even worth listening to. Still, it can't be considered nonsense when parts of it align with Kamoshida's confession. The same goes for the testimonies of the officers who arrested you. But so be it. At any rate, you mentioned something more important. Yeah, Mukau. Um, for those, the I don't know if you know this. I don't think you were around for the start of the Persona streams. You might have been, but I don't think you were. Basically, what happens is, like, so our character here gets arrested gets caught, um, I'm trying to do this without spoilers, but, like, he gets caught, and then this lady, Sai, starts interrogating him, and it's a, that's all at the start of the game, and then we go back in time, and lead up, everything leads up to this moment, this moment right here is what everything leads up to, like, this point in time. Um, not this exact point in time, it's a little later, but... Not the... Yeah, yeah, a lot of it. A lot of it. Not the entire game, though. Um... But you want to know something interesting? So at the start of the game... At the start of the game... Uh, when Joker is arrested... The, uh... You can see that the officers have injected him with some kind of drug. There you are, Chandler. Hi there. Uh, the officers have injected him with some kind of drug, and it's kind of making him kind of woozy. And he's he's still able to form coherent sentences and all that. He's, he's still, like, conscious. But if you miss any of the palace deadlines, like, if, uh, like... You know how Kamoshida's palace had a deadline you had to change his heart by. All the palaces have that. And if you fail to meet one of those deadlines, then there's a scene of Joker getting arrested at LeBlanc. And... Um... And it's like... The, the scene changes depending on... When, when... Which deadline you miss. The scene will change ever so slightly to match with the current narrative. But, this isn't actually what happens. The, the drug, it, it's explained that the drug injected a false memory or something in the Joker. And he's, and it's at this point he's pretty much no longer, not himself, but like, like he's no longer able to really, you know, function properly. At least for in, interrogation's sake. So Psy leaves him be and that's how you get the bad ending. Uh, because Sai leaves him to, to, you know, have time to clear his head, and then the bad ending happens. I'm not going to tell you what happens, because it kind of spoilers for later in the game, but you can probably guess what happens to him. It's Joker. But, yeah, so that's... I just thought that was really interesting, how, like, missing a deadline implants a false memory in his head. It's just really cool. This whole, the whole way they tell this story, the, the for like the first eight nines of the game, is really cool. These two other accomplices, besides this talking cat thing that appeared in your story, from what you've been telling me, they're students at the same school, aren't they? 
Perhaps? Don't take me for a fool. Very well, I'll leave it at that. Let's continue on. There are many more events that I must inquire on. Lies and false accounts are eventually exposed. The next to receive a calling card was this individual. A master of Japanese arts, Ichiryusai Matarame. Now, some... Whoops. Um, some people don't like... From what I've heard, some people don't like how they always reveal to you your next target before you even meet them in the actual game. Like, in your actual playthrough. Uh, but I think it's actually... I think it's actually a, um... Like, not a good thing, perhaps. I, I'm not a huge fan of it either. But... At one point in the game, when it's done, it's just like, holy crap, what? And I'm not going to tell you when that point is, but it'll become obvious once we get to it. It's even more incomprehensible than Kamoshida as to why this man was targeted. Where did you come to know him? And how did you learn of his crimes when you weren't a victim of them? Start by telling me what you all schemed. Yeah, some game stories are just completely unique. Like, you couldn't recreate it if you wanted to. There was something I was supposed to do tonight. Oh, it's just this. Oh. 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 No, no, don't kill the plant. The plant gives me kindness. Kill it with kindness. First off, I'd like to begin by congratulating you. To think our master would give words of praise. You better treasure this moment, inmate! You have encountered allies who share your aesthetics, and you have found your place in reality. The time has come. Your rehabilitation will soon begin. an inmate you have a special potential however that must be refined into a useful power it is weak now but refining it shall grant you the strength to stand against the coming ruin yeah, Igor's voice changed. It's not exactly my favorite, but eh. It is what it is. It's better than it could be, you know? Like, could be far worse. 
That is the rehabilitation cast upon you. There are various means by which you may gain the power to resist the ruin. Fighting shadows and gaining experience is one way. The fusion process I taught you prior is another. This is all possible because of our master's guidance, inmate. Though it may be presumptuous of us, we have words of wisdom as well. When you're out in reality, you better hone your relationships with those you have contracts with. Spending time with those people will lead to the cultivation of your relationships with them. Yeah, I know. I've played a Persona game before, you guys. <laughs> if you've got time to waste, you'd better visit your contractors, inmate. That is another source of power to evade the ruin that our master has mentioned. Thanks to the contracts you form, your heart is steadily gaining the power of opposition. It seems the rehabilitation is going well. This is a truly joyous occasion. I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. May the devotion to your rehabilitation grow even deeper. I have high hopes of you. All right, eight personas. All right. Yes. That'll be useful. The time has come. Return to your brief moments of rest. And don't forget to go talk to your contractor's inmate. Lend my Okay, quiet down. Oh, when are we gonna get to knowledge too? All right. It ain't much, but we've been getting more postings on the Phantom Aficionado website. I want to make my friend apologize for not returning the stuff I lent him. Deal with that yourself. Hey, those girls. You know that Phantom Thieves rumor about stealing Kamashita's heart? I wonder if it's true. It's gotta be made up. Do you seriously believe they exist? Okay, Muka. Oh, I need to get my laundry too, but I, I can't right now, and I'll just do it tomorrow. It's all done, I just need to grab it, so. But I'll do it tomorrow. He probably just couldn't keep hiding it after that girl tried to kill herself. Yeah, you might be right. I guess there's no way they really exist. Most importantly, it seriously sucks that our school is going to be known for stuff like this. I wonder if it'll affect our college entrance. That's probably a normal reaction for now, but they'll see soon enough. 
If we can take care of two or three famous guys, people will have to believe we exist. So about those big shots, we don't have any leads yet, right? Plus, there's that rumor about you two threatening Kamoshida, too. Looks like you'll just have to live a normal, honest school life for the time being. Still, make sure you stay prepared just in case anything comes up, all right? I'll keep an eye out for info on any big shots that might be coming around. And I'll try to dig up some dirt online. We went and formed the Phantom Thieves group, but we can't even find a target. There, there. I guess sometimes things just don't go the way we want them to. Excuse me. Did you wish to see me, Principal Kobayakawa? You saw the state Kamoshida-kun was in, didn't you? It's as if his personality has completely changed. Something is definitely wrong here. I'm not sure I follow. Business. Oh no. If they did something to him, who could they be? Are you saying that these students may have caused Mr. Kamashita to change? That is what I wish to know, even if it takes some probing into student matters. I would like you to look into this for me. It is true that there are many rumors regarding Mr. Kamashita. Do you mean all of this talk about those phantom thieves? It is undeniable that Mr. Kamoshida has changed in some way. <sighs> I'd like to have a grasp of the cause. Oh, God. Whew. Whew. I thought I had to sneeze, but okay, whatever. Guess I didn't. This shall also ensure that I handle the mass media and police in the correct fashion. I will continue speaking to Mr. Kamoshida myself. Unless you find whomever did this, these irresponsible rumors will likely never die down. Don't you agree? You have been at the top of your class since day one. Your conduct is good, and teachers favor you. I could write you a recommendation for any college of your choosing, Makoto Nijima. Thank you. Your lineage must certainly play a part in this excellence. Your sister is still young, yet she holds an admirable position at the public prosecutor's office, no? If something disappointing were to happen here, that wouldn't reflect very well on your sister. Do you understand? Yes. <laughs> How wise. It's no wonder you're our student council president. I'd appreciate if you'd look into this as soon as possible. I ask that you begin at once. Yes, if you'll excuse me then. It's me, sir. My apologies for troubling you at such a busy time. Yes, it's about the matter we discussed earlier. Hold up. Is covered. The investigation will begin immediately. Hey, Moo Cow. Um. Okay, so you didn't miss much. Uh, you did miss this scene with some girl and the principal. Um. This is basically what you missed. Uh, there's not much I want you to. No, but... Your sister is still young, yet she holds an admirable position at the public prosecutor's office, no? Hmm... 
Oh, and then he gets on the phone with someone. Mm -hmm, of course. Yes, I will get results. I should be able to update you soon. Yeah, ordinarily I wouldn't go back and do that, but it's... The scene is... It's not important per se, it's just got a little bit of foreshadowing in it. Well then, I must be going. Thank you very much for your time. Aficionado website? I'm the one who started it. Um, you guys are the Phantom Thieves, aren't you? Sorry. Although, if things really are as I think, I should keep it a secret. Kamoshida used me. And I did some horrible things to you guys. This isn't much of a way for me to apologize for it. But if there's anything I can do to help, just let me know. I'm glad to hear that. There are many more evil adults outside of Kamoshida. But I'm sure the Phantom Thieves will do something. They can't let this end after just one target. That's why I wanted to make a forum where people could post their problems. There are probably a lot of people who have high hopes for the Phantom Thieves' next move. So, I've also implemented an anonymous poll on the site. Do you believe in the Phantom Thieves or not? I hope someday my forum is filled with supportful posts. I'd really like to help out in the Phantom Thieves' acts of justice. Can I, please? I'll live up to your expectations. I promise. Besides the public's reaction to your group, there were others who supported you. Someone who enthusiastically cheered the Phantom Thieves on. Perhaps they were quite close. What do you have to say to that? I it shouted the birth of the Moon Persona. I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. This ability is useless for now, considering that we don't have any backup members, but it's it'll be nice to have pretty soon. We're not going to be stuck with four people forever. See you. We heard all that. Oh yeah, it's definitely less useless. Crap. It's definitely less useless when, um, when you do. Although I, I don't think they earn as much EXP, at least not at first. As you progress the rank, I think they eventually earn the same amount of EXP as your frontliners, but for now it'll be less. Jeez, it was a little awkward trying to figure out when to walk over here. So that forum is Mishima-kun's. 
Well, Enma, it's complicated. Um, at first they didn't want you to stream this game past, like, okay, basically what it is is you can't stream past, I think it's November 19th of the game. I think. Somewhere around there. Once we get to that point, I'm going to have to stop playing this, so I won't be able to play the complete game. But I hope I can provide you guys with some entertainment while I can play it. It used to be like July 9th or something you couldn't play past. But they changed that shortly after they put out that uh, announcement. So. It is what it is. But I mean, I've played it a couple times on, on stream and I haven't gotten banned yet, so... I think as long as I stay before the point where I have to stop, as long as I stop when I'm supposed to, I think it'll be fine. Is he figured out our identities? Even so, I think it'll be fine. He seemed to be playing it cool. I guess we should have a little chat about this later. I will say, though. A forum where people can post problems may prove unexpectedly useful. Anyways, we gotta get looking for a new target. And we need to stay sharp until we manage to find one. Once we do, we'll have to head into another palace. So we should prep our equipment and... Wait! Oh, crap! Uh, what's with you? Don't we have an exam coming up? Judging by that reaction, I'd assume you're going to struggle this time, too. It's not like you're any better. All you're good at is English. I'd rather that than be bad at every subject. Huh. <laughs> Even your Japanese is questionable at best, Ryuji. What's questionable is whether you're really even a human. <laughs> Good comeback, huh? Let's discuss this with our fists. Bring it. Will you two stop it? <laughs> I forgot about this scene. Okay. Yeah, 1119, that's what I thought. That's what I thought it was. It doesn't seem like they've lifted it despite the game being out for a year and a half, but whatever. Maybe they'll lift it by the time I get to that point, because God knows it'll be a while before we get there. Just Let's save. This. We haven't saved in a while. You know what, I think I'm gonna quit Persona and switch over to Toho Puppet Dance Performance because I I, it's, I I feel like playing that now and I don't know, I just, I don't know. Um, let's do that. Return to title. Yep. Although we probably won't see her, Len, but I don't think we can get her for a while. Uh... Okay, let's... 